Welcome to this tutorial on how to make Alexa turn your lights rainbow. In this video, we will guide you through the steps to achieve this colorful lighting effect using your Alexa device. To begin, make sure you have a compatible smart light bulb that supports color changing. This could be a Philips Hue bulb or any other brand that is compatible with Alexa. Step 1. Open the Alexa app on your smartphone or tablet. If you don't have the app, you can download it from the App Store or Google Play Store. Sign in. Step 2. Tap on the Devices tab at the bottom right corner of the app. Step 3. Next, tap on the plus icon at the top right corner to add a new device. Step 4. Select Add Device and choose the type of device you want to add. In this case, select Light. Step 5. Follow the on-screen instructions to connect your smart light bulb to the Alexa app. This usually involves putting the bulb into pairing mode and allowing the app to discover it. Step 6. Once your light bulb is successfully connected, you can now control it using Alexa. You can say commands like, Alexa, turn on the lights or, Alexa, set the lights to blue. Step 7. To make your lights turn rainbow, you can use a skill called Light Routines. Open the Alexa app and go to the Routines section. Step 8. Tap on the plus icon to create a new routine. Step 9. Give your routine a name such as Rainbow Lights. Step 10. Under When This Happens, select Voice and enter a phrase that will trigger the routine. For example, you can say Alexa, turn on the rainbow lights. Step 11. Under Add Action, select Smart Home and choose the light bulb you want to control. Step 12. Tap on color and select rainbow from the available options. Step 13. Save your routine and exit the app. Now, whenever you say the phrase you set up in step 10, Alexa will turn your lights into a beautiful rainbow. Enjoy the colorful ambiance in your home. That's it for this tutorial. We hope you found it helpful. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more tutorials like this.